Populating drawing boundaries from a seed file. In the previous section, within the DGN library, you designated areas using the drawing boundary feature. A drawing boundary is a predefined area on a sheet model which may contain a drawing. As you saw, the sheet may be subdivided into several drawing boundaries. In this section, you will start off by creating a new sheet model from the seed that contains drawing boundaries that you placed ahead of time in the DGN library. From there, you will use the name boundary tool to populate these drawing boundaries with a plan and profile. In this section, you will learn to create a sheet model that contains predefined drawing boundaries and place name boundaries based off the drawing boundaries delivered from the sheet model seed. Here, in the MicroStation Connect edition, begin by opening the Drainage Structures DGN file from the Roadway DGN folder of the SR20 project. Here, you will find that this file is nearly complete. The name boundaries have been created as an array that follows the corridor. All but one of the sheets, based off the contents of the said name boundaries, has been created along with their respective profiles. You will create and finish the last sheet of the drain structures group and then place all the sheets into the sheet index. Along the ribbon, click the View tab. In the lower right corner of the Name Boundary ribbon group, click the Dialog Launcher to open the Name Boundaries dialog. In the Name Boundaries dialog, expand the Drainage Structures group. Select the Drainage Structures Station 1072 to 1079 Name Boundary. Then, from the icon bank of the dialog, click Create Drawing. In the Create Drawing dialog, set the following options. For the name, Drainage Structures Station 1072 to 1079. Plan Sheet Only for the Drawing Seed. The Create Sheet Model option enabled. This will be a new sheet. For the Drawing Boundary, NB PP Plan. Take note. The NBPP plan drawing boundary was created in the Civil Drawing Seed DGN library, along with the NBPP profile that you will use in the upcoming step. 1 inch equals 50 feet, described by the name boundary. The option, Add the Sheet Index, disabled, and then the Open Model option, enabled. Click OK to create and open up the Drain Structures Station 1072 to 1079 sheet model. The plan section is referenced to the upper portion of the plan profile sheet. Next, you will reference the respective profile to the lower portion via drawing boundary. Open the PRO FRD01 DGN file and then zoom into the left side of the profile. As a hint, to aid in locating the profile section for this exercise, apply the state view location for course exercise. Make the place name boundary tool active. Set the following options in the tool settings window. For the method from drawing boundary, the NBPP profile drawing boundary, for the name RD profile station 1072 to 1079, for the detail scale 1 inch equals 50 feet, for the mode place a single name boundary and make sure that the create drawing option is enabled. Using the midpoint snap mode, snap and enter a data point on the edge of the profile grid as shown. In the Create Drawing dialog, set the following options. For the name, RD Profile Station 1072 to 1079. 
the plan sheet only drawing seed, ensure that the create sheet model option is enabled, enable the file name checkbox. And then from here, select the drainage structures DGN file. For the sheet, drainage structures station 1072 to 1079. Take note that you may need to scroll to the bottom of this listing. For the drawing boundary, NB PP profile. One inch equals 50 feet for the detail scale. And then make sure that the open model option is enabled. From here, click OK. With the contents of the plan name boundary and the profile name boundary referenced to the drain structures station 1072 to 1079 sheets drawing boundaries, the sheet as well as the drain structures group is now complete. Next, you will add this group to the sheet index. Open the Explorer dialog if it is not already open. From the icon bank of the sheet index tab, click Open Sheet Index for edit. Expand SR20 and then expand the Drainage Plans Profiles folder. Open the Models dialog. From the Models dialog, select all of the sheets. Make sure not to include the design model Drainage Composition. Now, drag the selection set of models and drop these onto the Drainage Plans Profiles folder. Once the plan profile sheets are added to the sheet index, drag the four retention pond plans to the bottom of the folder so that they come after the plan and profile sheets. Right click on the Drainage Plans Profiles folder and then choose Update Sheet Model Properties. In this section, you learn to create a sheet model that contains predefined drawing boundaries and place name boundaries based off the drawing boundaries delivered from the sheet model seed. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.